today we're going to discuss the grip and we're going to do it as a right-handed golfer okay so the golfer here is going to put his hands on correctly one time left hand first so he's going to grip in the fingers wrap and pinch on top with the thumb just slightly on the back side of the grip you can notice the V pointing towards the right side for this right-handed golfer then the bottom hand is going to come in from underneath interlocking the index finger in the pinky, the V pointing back towards the same shoulder. Notice the hands connected. This is what we want to create stability and helping create good shots through the rough, fairway, bunkers, and all the situations that arise. This is the example of a good grip. This is the example of a poor, weaker grip, okay? So where the golfer puts the hand, the grip into the palm too much, the arm will tend to be bent a little bit and a little riding high. You'll notice the V is pointing towards the left shoulder in a very weak position as this is a right-handed golfer. So right-handed golfers, you want both those Vs pointing over towards the right side correctly. But you can see when it's in a weak position, that's compromised. Also take note of where the back of the hand's pointing down towards the ground. This is something that we want to fix. Um, in order for you to have long arms at impact in a steady arc. So once again, there's the fix and the weak grip in the palms right there. That will lead to you having a lot of inconsistent ground interaction with the ball and the club and also have a tough time out of the rough when the uh, grass gets grabbing the club head through impact areas.